Good morning, Wooten Patriots. I'm Anna. And I'm Uriel. Today is Monday, October 28th, and these are your morning announcements. Today we start the announcements with a special, special message from Principal Nelson. Good morning, Wooten High School. This is Mr. Nelson. I am here this morning to provide you with an update on information regarding the initiative IDs for All that is coming to Wooten High School. As a reminder, this expectation is in place across all MCPS high schools, and Wooten soon will be moving to full implementation, meaning students will have to have an ID on and visible each day at school. As a reminder, the purpose of this initiative is to ensure that we are safe at school. This is everyone's responsibility. An update on information. IDs for all will be implemented beginning Wednesday, October 30th. And what that means is students and staff should be prepared on Wednesday, October 30th to have your school provided ID on your person, wearing it so that it is visible. There will be a grace period until Monday, November 11th. Then we will move to full implementation. And what I mean by that is, while well, you will get a reminder, on November 11th, it will be an expectation that if you do not have your ID, then you will need to have some alternative way of displaying that you are supposed to be here at school, which will be a name badge, a way that you can show that you have picked up something that you are displaying and individuals can see. So students who do not have an ID following November 11th will be asked to go to the main office to pick up that alternative identification. IDs are to be worn on your person so that it is visible every day while at school. IDs should be displayed while in building the building during school hours, but also at school sanctioned events after school, like a game, a theater program, something that is an MCPS sanctioned event. IDs can be on a school provided lanyard. They can also be clipped on your person. They can be worn on a backpack. But what that means is if you go outside of a classroom, you must move with your backpack. You can do like I do, and you can wear that on your belt so that you can see it. Whatever way you would like to wear your ID, the purpose here is that it can be seen and that it is visible. And students, I want to be clear with you, if we cannot see your ID, then you should expect to have a question about making your ID visible or a question about retrieving your ID and making sure that it is worn. This is what you need to know. Students are provided with a school ID. You will have one replacement that is provided free of charge. You will be able to go to security in order to do that. And after that, there will be a $5 charge to then pick up another ID. Students who do not bring their ID will be provided with a daily name tag or some way that designates that you have a daily um, name tag that shows you are still supposed to be here at school. And students who arrive to school after the late bell, you will start scanning your school ID. This will send an email to your teacher, which will state that you were late to school. So please be sure to be on time. And remember, after those late bells ring, you're going to have to scan showing that you came to school late. And students may decorate lan lanyards or ID holders in whatever way that you would like to do that. But please remember, uh, we cannot replace them once you have decorated them. So again, let's summarize. Beginning October 30th, please be sure that you have your ID visible and worn to school. There will be stations that check you in and make sure that IDs are visible. And on November 11th, we will move to full implementation. All right, thank you very much, Wooten High School. Have a great day. Seniors, tomorrow, Tuesday, the 29th, will be the senior panoramic photo during advisory. Be sure to be there on time to make sure you are included in this picture. That will be included in the yearbook. The autism program is selling friendship bracelets and cookies in the commons during advisory every Monday. Take your pick between freshly baked chocolate chip cookies or double chocolate chip cookies. For just $3, you can buy a friendship bracelet and one cookie, or for $5, you can buy a friendship bracelet and two cookies. Please bring cash only. All proceeds go towards our program's community trips. Are you missing a water bottle or lunch bag? Can't seem to remember where you left your coat or umbrella? Then come check out the Lost and Found in the main office workroom. We have a large collection of misplaced items that need to be claimed by their owners. On Friday, November 1st, all unclaimed, all unclaimed items will be removed from the workroom and donated to a local organization that will make use of them. Homework Club meets in room 182 every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday during the school year from 2.30 to 3.30 p.m. Tutors are provided in all subject areas. Are you interested in traveling this upcoming summer? If so, consider joining us in Ireland. Ms. Custer is leading an EF tour abroad to Ireland this upcoming summer and you are invited. 
will visit the famous cliffs of Mohair, Kilkenny, Dublin, and Galway. If you are a capstone or humanity student, this trip can count as your required summer experience. The registration deadline and $400 discount has been extended to October 31st, so don't wait. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Custer in room 216 or scan the QR code to access the registration website. This is not an MCPS or school-sponsored event. The Patriot players are excited to invite you to both of our fall shows. Elephant and Piggy, We Are in a Play brings the beloved Mo Williams characters to life in a family-friendly musical adventure perfect for all of your elementary people in your life. For something completely different, Game of Tiaras is a comedy that pits your favorite Disney princesses against each other in a bloody fight to the death. Come cheer as Snow White is beheaded and swords are drawn. This show is PG-13. Tickets on sale now at www.cur8.com. Those interested in trying out for boys basketball, there will be an interest meeting this Wednesday at the beginning of lunch in the main gym. Tryout and registration information will be discussed. And now for Monday's meaningful moment. The meaning of life is to find your gift. The purpose of life is to give it away by Pablo Picasso. That's it for us today. I'm Anna. And I'm Uriel. Remember to walk the Wooten way as you walk wise and drive wise. Have, Have a, a great, great day, day Wooten. Wooten.